Steam gauges. Um, 20, 230, 42, location of the gauges. Every bowler should have at least one steam gauge, which correctly indicates the working pressure of the gauge should be positioned so that it will reasonably be cool, conveniently be re read by the engine crew. The gauge or the siphon, the siphon gauge will supply with it, shall have the siphon that may have ample capacity to prevent the steam. The entire gauge of the supply pipe is directly enter the bar boiler into the maintained steam line. The supply pipe and the connection shall be connected, cleaned each time the gauge is tested. 234. 23044 test time testing steam gauges shall be test prior to the install being applied during the 92 service day inspection whatever the irregular method 23045 the method of testing some gauges shall be compared to accurately test gauges dead weight of the tester while under test load is the MAWP the boiler to which the gauge will, uh, will be applied the gauge will be read to the pressure that accurate and the physical limitations of the gauge will allow under this test the gauge of the shell read to the manufacturer tolerance all points of the gauge at 25% of the loud pressure. If the manufacturer tolerance is not known, the gauge must read 2% full scale accuracy at all points of the gauge up to 25% of the loud, above all loud pressure. 23046 of the badge plates. The metal badge plate shown in the loud steam pressure that attached to the boiler backhead of the cat in the cab. The boiler backhead is lag the lagging uh, lagged and the lagging and the jacket shall be cut away for the, so the place can be seen. 23047 the boiler number. Generally, the boiler builder's number of the boiler is known, but it shall be stamped on the same dome of the manhole flange. The builder's number that cannot be obtained is signed of the number which shall be used in making the out. The specification cards shall be stamped on the same dome or the manhole flange. Name number of, after the January number ti numbers after January 10th, 1912. Numbers shall be stamped with the date after January 10th, 1912. Shall be located on the front side of the steam dome on the manhole flange and the upper edge of the vertical shell. Or if it's oriented horizontal, man the figure is at least three eighths of an inch high. Inch high. No more name of the manufacturer owner. The number shall be preceded with the name of the manufacturer. Original number is known, and on the name of the steam locomotive owner is the new number assigned. Safety relief valves. I guess I'll continue. Safety review the e valves. Number and capacity. Number and capacity. Each boiler is, shall be equipped with at least two safety re re relief valves suitable for the service intended for the capable of preventing accumula accumulation of the pressure greater than 66% 6 of the MAWP under the conditions of service of the FRA. Inspector, FRA inspector, which may require verification of sufficiently safety valve relieving capacity. Determination of the capacity of safety relieving valve capacity may be determined by making, making accum, accumul, accumulations testing with the fire is good or the bright condition and all seams outlets closed. Additional safety relief valve capacity should provide a safety relief valve and shall also access pressure of more than 6% of the MAWP during the test 23049. Safety setting safety relief valves. Qualification of two of individuals who adjust safety relief valves shall be set by the adjusting the component person who is thoroughly familiar with the construction operation of the valve being set. The op opening the pressure at least one of the safety relief valves shall will be shall be set open to the pre pressure not to exceed the MAWP. Safety relief valve shall be open set on the pressure not exceeding six a six ps of the MWA M MAWP. Setting procedure when safety safe, when setting safety relief valves two seam gauges shall be used one which we should be located in the full view of the person engaged in the setting of the, such valves the pressure indicating the gauges valve varies on the three psi removed the boiler tested corrected before the safety relief valves are set the gauges shall in all cases be tested immediately before the safety valve relief valves are in any change made of the setting the setting safety relief valves water level shall not be laid uh, that that be higher than three quarters of an inch length of visible water gas. This is measured from the bottom of the glass lit. Labeling the lo lo lowest set, set pressure. The set pressure to lower safety relief valve of the shell indicate the tag will attach to the steam gauge and the, that may be clearly read to the observing steam gauge. 23050. The time testing all, time, all safety relief valves shall be tested in accordance or adjusted if necessary under the steam every 30, 92 severance days also, also whenever the irregularity is reported. We'll continue. Water glasses and gauge cocks. Number and location. Every boiler shall be equipped with at least two water glasses. The lowest reading of the water glass shall not be less than three inches above the highest part of the crown sheet. If the gauge cocks are out or are used, or the reading of the lowest gauge cocks shall not be less than three inches above the highest part of the crown sheet. 
the water glass valves. A water glass shall be equipped with no more than two valves capable of isolating water glass from the boiler. They shall be equipped with a drainage valve capable of excavating the glass when it's isolated. 23053 time cleaning the spindles of all water glass valves and all gauge cocks shall be removed with the valves cocks. Thoroughly cleaned and scales for sediment every in every 31 service days inspection testing indicates the apparatus of the mouth by the mal- malfunction. Additional top bottom passages water column shall be cleaned and inspected in an annual inspection. Annually inspected. 23054 and testing all the water glasses must be blown out. All gauge cocks must be tested. Uh, all passages verified to be uh, open to the beginning at the each end of the locomotive is used as often necessary to ensure the proper ma- function. Maintenance gauge cocks, water column, drain valves, water glass valves must be maintained in each such condition that easily open and closed by hand without hate or wrench or the other tool. Tubular tile. Th- 23055 tubular tile water lubricator glass shell. Shields, water glass, tubular tiles, water glass shall be renewed every in each 92 service days inspection. Shield, shields of tubular water glass, lubricator glass must be equipped within a safety suitable shield, which will prevent the glass from flying in the ca- flying in the case of the breakage. And this should be properly maintained in location and maintenance. When water gauge glasses, water ga- glass shield shall be made located in construction. Maintenance of the engine crew can at all times have an obstructed view of the water glass in the proper position in the cab. 23056 of water glass lamps. All water glass is must be supplied to the suit, suitable probable located to enable the engine crew to easily see the water in the glass. Injectors and feed water pumps and flu flu plugs. Injectors, feed water pumps, water delivery and system required. Each system in the locomotive must be equipped with at least two means of delivering water to the boiler, at least one which was the live steam injector. Maintenance and testing injectors, feed water pump must be kept in a good condition free of scale, must be t- this is at the beginning of each of the day locomotive is and is often required to ensure that they are delivering water to the boiler. The boiler checks the delivery pipes, the feed water pipes, tank hose, tank valves must be kept in good condition, free of leaks and foreign substances that would obstruct the flow of water. See the bracing and spin injectors, feed water pumps also in, in associated with the pipe shell and securely braced, braced so maxim, to minimize br- Vibration of flu plugs when plugging is when plugging is permitted the flu is greater than two and quarters of an inch, two and one quarter of an inch outside outside the diameter of the OD the outside diameter shall not be plugged in. It flu is two two and a quarter of an inch and the outside diameter of the OD smaller than maybe the plug following the failure, providing only one of the flu plug is at any any, any one time. The plugs must be removed proper to the repair and the made no later than thirty days to the time of the plug is applied. Method of plugging. When used, the flue plugs must be made of steel. The flue must be made, be plugged at both ends. And plugs must be tied together to mean a steel rod not less than five eighths of an inch in diameter. Fusible plugs. Fusible plugs. The, ma- the, p- the boilers equipped with fusible plugs. The plugs shall be removed and cleaned at a scale. Each of the boiler washed out, but not less frequently during the, every 31 service days. This removal shall be noted. The FRA form number one. FRA form number two. Three, you see the appendix of this port washing the boiler. Washing the boiler.